They've been in prison for months now, and according to this Cairo court, they should stay there for seven more years. Reactions from the international community came swiftly. Australia, Europe, the United States. But it's been the outcry from media organizations and journalists that have been loudest. What happened in court in Egypt today was unjust in the extreme. From the very beginning, the charges against our guys were absurd. We will explore every avenue, both legal, from the campaigning and from the lobbying. The support is already there, the worldwide support and solidarity that will get louder and we will leave no stone unturned. We need to ensure that justice does prevail in Egypt and that our journalists are freed as soon as possible. Top UN officials have also expressed their concern. They include UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon and UN Rights Chief Navi Pillay. Navi Pillay added that she too was shocked and alarmed by the verdicts and heavily, heavy jail sentences between seven and ten years handed down to three Al Jazeera journalists on Monday as well as 11 other defendants who were tried in absentia. The journalists Peter Greste, Mohamed Fahmi and Bahir Mohamed now face a lengthy appeal process that could see them spend several more months behind bars. So many are calling for a presidential pardon which could see them free in moments. Susan Mongeli, CCTV.